it is Bubs. So today I'm going to be doing an updated what's in my handbag video because it suddenly occurred to me that my last one was four years ago. Four years ago. What happened? The Olympics already happened. World Cup already happened. I figured it'll be handy because I can show you guys apps that I use on my phone, um, the ones I use to take pictures and do a little bit of editing with, and the camera that I use to vlog with because I get quite a lot of questions regarding that. So let's check out what's inside my handbag. It's not that interesting, you know, unfortunately, no magic tricks, no knives and stuff. Not well, that's fortunately actually. I have to say, I honestly don't bring a lot with me normally, okay? Most of the days, I don't even bring a handbag with me. I just bring my phone and my ID and that's me out. Tim usually carries like a little bag with him, so I put some of my stuff in there, but most of the time I'm, you know, free handing, free bowling, not free bowling. No, I, I don't free ball. Don't look it up and don't imagine me free balling, please. But when I really do go out, out, you know, when I'm seeing someone or if I'm going shopping or just if I need to carry more, this is the bag that I carry. This is um, a birthday treat that I got for my 27th birthday. Unlike um, a lot of designer leather bags, um, they scratch easily, but this one, it's waterproof. I don't have to worry as much and it doesn't scratch and it just wears better. Of course, you can hold it like this, but I'm not really the type that likes to carry bags like this because it gives me sore shoulders. Most of the time, I just carry it like this. So you guys ready to see what's inside my bag? Let's start with my vlogging camera. So everywhere I go, most of the time, I would bring my vlogging camera with me. And a lot of guys ask me about the model of this camera. So this is Sony NEX 3N. And uh, what I like about this camera is it has a, a little flip screen. So when I vlog, I can see myself so I don't go out of focus. And uh, of course, you can use it to take pictures. You can use it for vlogging. I love it. You can even change the lenses as you can see. I actually took this camera to our honeymoon rather than the big DSLR that I'm using to film because it's lighter and it takes pretty good pictures. Um, obviously not as high quality as a DSLR but good enough. I always bring a scarf with me uh, on the go. This is actually a gift from my girlfriend and she got it from Forever 21. I really do love this scarf but it's just handy to bring with me, you know, no matter how hot it is outside. Um, when I'm in a car and the sun just blasting in my face and I want to protect it from sun damage, I just I just go like this. Like, doesn't matter. Like, people would look at me and I'd be like, so. When aircon gets a bit too strong inside a restaurant or a mall, I can just take this out and just wrap this over my neck. Sometimes when I'm out and I forget to bring like a hood with me, then I just go like this and I just wrap this over my head. It does a lot of stuff. I just love having a scarf and especially scarves like this where it's nice and lightweight. I have crackers because, you know, now that I'm knocked up, like I, I just get hungry really quick. You do not want me hungry, okay? Like before pregnant, like when I'm hungry or tired, dangerous territory but now that you know i'm also pregnant you just don't want to make me hungry okay i will i will eat you up of course i have gum to be minty fresh especially after a meal tissues because every self-respected hong kong person owns a packet of tissues you know because sometimes when you go to the toilet if they're nice you may get tissue sometimes they don't even give you any tissue paper so you just you just gotta be safe and, and sorry. Sometimes tissues just don't cut it, so it's nice to have wet wipes. Another thing that every person living in Hong Kong would carry with them would be one of these pouches, and inside would of course be their octopus card where you use to travel, beat yourself in, beat yourself out. You will use this to shop, it's just so handy. You just top it up and you can just buy stuff with it. So the one I have is a limited version that Tim got for me. It's um, a tiger one because I'm born in here of the tiger. I have hand cream because sometimes my hands get really dry especially after using wet wipes or using those um, those antibacterial gels some eye drops here because sometimes my eyes can get really dry being in Hong Kong sometimes you get these little suckers called mosquitoes it just comes in handy whenever like my friends get bitten or Tim gets bitten then I'm like oh of course I have my wallet every time I use a wallet I use it for at least five six years because I get really attached to them and it's got gold detail as you can see uh, you open up like this, you have the coin pouch, and then you open it like this, you put your cards here, and then it's got like a big slot for you to put your notes inside. I have my phone. Some apps that's probably worth mentioning is I have something called Nature Space. 
and deep calm and uh, sometimes I just can't sleep so what I do, I put on some nature sleeping songs. Can you imagine sleeping to this? Just imagine being in a fire. Not a fire, uh, like, you know, a fire lit by near you as you sleep in a hammock. Personally, I find the seagulls really annoying, so... But you can actually turn off the seagulls, which is really handy. Makes you want to sleep already, doesn't it? This is the app that I use to take my pictures. It's in Chinese, but you can type in me too in your app store. And it's awesome, like you can use it to take pictures. It's actually quite a popular app that a lot of people here use in Asia. Okay, and it automatically puts a beauty filter on it and just makes you look, I don't know, it does something to you. I think it makes your skin look nicer and makes your eyes look more twinklier or something. But that would be the only thing that I use. You can do like obviously a bunch of other editing stuff on it. I think like remove your dark circles and but uh, I don't really use those ones. Another app that I use is also from May Too. You want to like put certain filters to it, whatever you want, like um beauty filters, there's a whole bunch of them, but I'm not gonna use it today. This is what I normally use it for. If I want to add little hearts, just to make it look a bit more prettier. Sometimes when I'm bored, I go on BuzzFeed and I like to read the DIY section because sometimes they have pretty cool ideas there. Sometimes when I take a picture and it's too long for me to put on Instagram, basically what I do is I put it on Whitegram. So it puts it like, like a white border at the side so I can use that. I have a bunch of pregnancy apps here. Um, the ones that I like using are I'm Expecting. I quite like what to expect as well. I always have a little mini uh, crocodile clip here. Sometimes my hair gets annoying so I go like this and I just clip it up like this so it's comfortable and I'm all happy when I go shopping. Um, ooh, I always have lip balm with me. In fact, I actually have two lip balms here. I also always have a type of lipstick or um, lip gloss in every handbag that I use. So here I also have two. Both of them are from Etta House and this one is my favorite color. It's in... PK002, which is a really cute pink and it really does tint your lips. And this one is also a pinky color as well. And this one is in number two as well. I think my bag is almost empty now. Oh, one more thing. I have headphones. Sometimes people carry like the big enormous headphones out. It's just it's too much effort for me because like, you know, I've got enough stuff in my bags. I like to listen to not only music when I go out, but I like to listen to podcasts, especially when I'm out traveling and most time when I travel, I travel for at least 30, 30 minutes, maybe up to an hour. I guess this video wasn't as interesting as I thought it would be, but I hope you guys still enjoyed it nonetheless. Thank you guys so much for watching and I shall see you soon. Bye everybody!